What's up guys, this is Jimbo here from the Jimbo Slice YouTube channel. Uh, what I have for you today is, I got no table. Um, but I got something for you today. Um, what we have here, hopefully you can see this, is the Rockwell Jaw Horse Sheet Master. Um, I got this, I won uh, the April giveaway on the Tools in Action forum. It was a hundred dollar Amazon gift card, so I put it towards the uh, the Sheet Master. Um, why I went with this particular model over the standard jaw horse is the expanded. You can hold up to um, four feet, so you can hold whole sheets of plywood on here. And I'll show you when we get a little closer look. It is a more stable model. It has feet on all three legs of it. Yep, three legs. So you'll see how that works. We get set up to breeze, and we we'll got it all hooked up for you, so you can see how she works. Okay guys, so setup is is a breeze here. Um, it's got some good weight to it, okay? But it's not so heavy that it is just ridiculously heavy. So right here, um, these legs here, they fold out. You can see the nice feet on them, okay? And that helps to the stability. It's about the size of my hand here, okay? So that's real nice. And you got some wheels here, okay? The wheels here are gonna help you move it around. Now right here, I'm gonna rotate this back around. This is your kind of your release lever, or it's it's basically just a wing nut, okay? So it's gonna allow this leg to slide down. I'll show you, there's some pins down in there uh, where it locks up in here, pull down, and this comes out, okay? And it locks in right there. And then you Screw that down, tighten it, okay? Now, you flip it on the side, okay? However you're gonna use it. So face it this way. Now, you have to make sure that you have the jaw horse in the unlocked position, all right? On the handle down here, I'll show you guys, there's a little release latch lever, so this comes down, okay? So, I'm all muddy. So once you have that unlocked, release it, and now you can slide your draws all the way out. I mean, you can, you can take it totally off. This will hold up to, I want to say it's four feet. Let's see. Yeah, you can actually flip this around, I believe. So you can flip this either way. And this will go up to four feet. Yep. And this is for your larger surfaces. Okay, now we're still unlocked, so this will pull right out. And for your smaller pieces, this comes around like that, okay? And all you do is you crank down until you get to the size that you want. So for example, I have the sheet of plywood here. Be careful not to buckle it. What did I do here? Very good. So once it's in there, nice. Okay, you lash it down. All right. So it's not always the most stable. This is real thin ply, but what it does come with, it comes with this bracket where you can put a two by four and a two by four and it'll give you a cross member for your real large sheets, okay? So it's a real nice unit. It's gonna be very versatile for a lot of projects. You can clamp a whole array of things. 
So the unit itself is, is very stable. I mean, I'll sit on it. Holds me no problem, and I'm not the lightest person, so. And then, well, uh, you could actually, it's got some holes where if you wanted, you could bolt it to your floor. So, let's flip this back around. And then, uh, let's cut a little bit on it. So the key to the stability of this thing, I can sit on here. Oh, that's going to tip a little bit, but if you look here, a little, little bit better. Obviously, if I sit all the way on the edge, it's going to tip, but I'm, I'm sitting pretty, I mean, my weight's mostly centered, but it's still on the side here. There. That's the locking force of this. This thing has two tons of clamping. Is it two tons or one ton? I got the box right here. It's one ton. Yeah, it's one, one ton of clamping force. So, I mean, you can see, all right, I, she's locked in there. And I'm not even holding on to this board here. You guys know my older Black & Decker would have been all over the place. Okay? So, you see how just rock solid this thing really is. And I'm pushing all sorts of hell on the side of this board here. Okay? So it doesn't matter what type of pressure I put on what side of this board. This bad boy is going to hang on to it. easy this is to just fold up and put away so this is a rock solid um, unit here so again big thanks to the crew for voting me to win the giveaway big thanks to Dan and Eric over at Tools in Action for making these monthly giveaways possible I strongly suggest you guys get on that forum participate make friends with us out there and you'll probably win something we're always doing giveaways so uh, just an update on my MM100 giveaway. That's going to be Memorial Day. So you got got about three weeks left to get your videos in. So thanks for watching, guys.